So welcome everybody. Happy August, almost September. Who all has gone to get their pumpkin spice latte today? I know uh, Kanya does not like pumpkin spice, but a lot of us sure do. So this is the best season that we're entering in. And I'm so thankful that you guys are all on the call tonight. My name is Emily Burgess. I am a diamond ambassador out of Boise, Idaho. All that means is that I am very passionate about these products and I'm very passionate about helping men and women find some freedom in their time and in their finances. Um, and so this has been something I've been doing very passionately and purposefully for the past six and a half years. And the stories that I have heard over the six and a half years have been so beautiful, bring you to tears and make everybody just want to tell somebody about it because we all have so many people that we know of in our lives or we have people who are silently suffering that we don't know about, but we have so many people who could benefit from more energy in a clean way or a better digestion, a better mood. We have so we have so many people in this world who struggle with anxiety and just so, so many things that are stemmed out of the gut. And so it's been really beautiful to see and hear so many different stories with myself, my husband, my family, and so many other people included. So tonight we're gonna have a few women, um, all educators in some way, they're all educators and they're going to share a little bit about their story on the health side, how the products have helped them in their health. And what I want to do as a thank you for being on this call tonight is I'm going to do a couple of giveaways at the end of the call. If you are a guest, meaning you don't like sell or promote Plexus, you might be a customer, you might be at a place right now where you're just kind of trying to figure this out. Like, is this something that you may be interested in trying down the road? I want you in the chat. So if you're a guest, not a business builder in the chat, I would like for you to say, uh, you know, I'm I where you're from and who invited you and then you will be going into a drawing and at the end of our call tonight, we should only be on for about 25 30 minutes at the end of our call tonight, I will announce who those winners are so in the chat. Go on over, tell me who, who you are, where you're from, who invited you if you are a guest. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and pass it off to my dear friend Angela she tells us a little bit about her story and remember. These women, just with the theme of back to school, these women have education in their background. And so that's kind of what the common theme is here. So go ahead, Angela, I'll pass it off to you. Angela, are you there? I wonder if you're frozen. Okay, she looks like she might be frozen. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna switch over to Sarah Joe, and then we'll have Angela jump on after Sarah Joe. Sarah Joe, are you good to go? All right, go ahead. Well, hi guys. Um, can everybody hear me? Okay, Emily, I can see you. Can you hear? Me? Okay, just make it sure. Um, I'm very excited to be here tonight. I'm gonna set my timer to make sure that I don't, you know, use the whole night. I am a teacher. I can get very long winded. Um, anyways, I'm very excited to be here. Um, so my journey with Plexus started about two years ago. And I'd heard about it before, but I'd always heard it in relation to weight loss. And I thought that I was just going to eat better and I was just going to exercise more and it would all be okay. And, um, newsflash that was not working. I was doing good eating well, <laughs> I was working out, but I was still just getting really stuck. Um, but my friend Rachel came to me, she said, Hey, I'm looking into this gut health thing. Do you know anything? I was like, well, I know some stuff about gut health, but. I don't know. She's like, well, come to my event. And I was like, well, okay, I'm a good friend. I'm going to come to her event, you know, because I love her. And um, I learned all kinds of stuff about gut health and how it literally affects like everything. And I was like, oh my gosh. Okay. So I think I might need to look at this. So I talked to my husband and I said, okay, well, here's the deal, Ben, my husband's name. Um, I really want to try this. Nothing is working. Now, here was my problem. I had no energy, like zilch. I came home from teaching all day and I went straight to the recliner. And I have a very sweet husband because I don't know how he would have survived because he was the one getting the kids ready for bed and cooking dinner and trying to keep the house going while he worked. 
because I just came home and I'm like, I'm so mentally spent physically and mentally. I cannot do this. And, um, so he was wonderful about that, but I had zero energy to give my children. And that is not the mom I wanted to be. I did not want a mom from the couch. I did not want a mom in my case from the recliner. I wanted to be involved. I wanted to have the mama. Hey, would you come ride bikes with us? Mama can't mama. Can we go play outside? I was like, you go play. I'll sit on the porch because mama, mama can't like, that's how exhausted I was. I felt horrible. I'd actually gotten a diagnosis from the doctor that I had non-alcoholic fatty liver and I wouldn't know what I was going to do with that, but I was headed down a not good road with that too. And, um, so I was like, then I just, let's just try. There's a 60 day money back guarantee. Let's try this. And if it doesn't work, if we don't see any budget of anything, I will get my money back. Like, can we make this happen? He said, okay, let's look at it. Let's make the 30 day, the six, sorry, the three month, which is 90 days. I can't math. I teach music. I just have to count to four. I'm just kidding. Um, but anyways, so he said, let's, let's do the three months. We'll, we'll commit to that. We've got enough money. We're going to commit to the three months and let's see what happens. I said, okay, great. So I did. And within just a couple weeks, I started having energy and it was kind of like, not something that was just like, bam. It was like, I came home and I started cooking dinner. And then I realized I came home and I started cooking dinner. Um, I came home and we cooked dinner and then we went to practices. And instead of sitting in my chair, like just waiting for practice to be done, I was playing with my kids and I was playing catch with the one that didn't have practice. Um, I was highly irregular. I thought it was normal not to go to the bathroom, but once a week, maybe twice a week. Um, that's not normal. You're supposed to go two to three times a day. Um, so I was having a lot of stomach issues. So real quick, I'll kind of Roll it up. So I now have energy to where my students at school go, why do you have more energy than us, Miss Morris? That's just weird. And I'm like, I don't know, I take care of myself. That's why. Um, I now have the energy to get up and go work out in the mornings at 5 a.m. I'm at the gym. I would never, ever, if I was running, you'd better be running too. Something was chasing me kind of situation. And I enjoy getting my body moving now. I now go to the bathroom regularly. So all of the stomach aches and the inflammation and the bloating, like I've lost 13 inches off my waist and it was a lot of just inflammation that my body had accumulated. I, my liver enzymes are great. I am no longer in the non-alcoholic fatty liver disorder, blah, blah, blah stuff. Like I'm good. And it's because I have taken these and balanced my gut. I had no idea my overwhelm and anxiety from just like teaching all day and taking on my students' problems and trying to figure out, not that I can solve them, but I want to try. That's no longer overwhelming to me. There are so many things that are connected to our gut. Like get with the person who has invited you. I please, please, please get with the person that has invited you and ask these questions and tell them what you want to see happen in your body between like what changes you would like to see happen. I am such a better teacher now than I was when I, before I started my products. And I, that's not a testament to my lack of training and ability. It was, I have the energy and the mental clarity now to do what I need to do for my students at a much better capacity, as well as my family, as well as my husband. So now I'm able to feel like I'm successful as a mom and a wife. I'm, I'm playing with my kids. I have energy to, to sit down and have a conversation with my husband at the end of the day. And that's huge. So this has changed everything for me and it's changed everything for my family. And I, I just get with a person who invited you and ask the questions. There are no silly questions. There are no like too personal questions in my opinion. Like I will talk to you all day about being regular because nobody talks about it and it's a big problem, <laughs> you know? And so anyways, I will pass it off to, I've got to figure out where we switched. So let me, yeah, I remember so who was after Angela me. Angela is in the middle of Angela. a storm. Angela's in the middle of a storm. So her power is out. So we're just going to see if she's able to make her way on. She's got a great story, but if she can't tell it tonight, maybe we'll have her share it in our testimonial page. So you guys can hear it at a later time. Sarah, thank you so much for sharing. So beautiful. And I love that it is affecting not just you, but your family, your boys, your students. So beautiful. Okay, we'll go ahead and pass it on to Valerie. 
Hey, I am. Can y'all hear me? Are we good? Um, I am super excited to get to share with you guys tonight. And I love Sarah's story because I'm a music teacher, too. And I understand the stress of being a music teacher. This is my 32nd year to teach. And um, while I love my students, love my job, the stress takes a toll. And so where I found myself two years ago was um, pushing 200 pounds, the largest I'd ever been in my life, and also having um, PPP, which is plantar pustular psoriasis and inflammatory arthritis. And so those are autoimmune and I had no idea it was gut related. I just knew I was miserable. And so we had come off vacation in August of 2021. And my husband said, I'm really worried about you. I'm worried about your health. And we had seen Casey um, at church. And we had seen her journey and how much weight she lost. So he said, call her and check with her. And so I did. And it didn't take but a short chat that I distinctly remember saying, here is my credit card number. I don't care what it costs do it. I've got to do something. And um, I started the triplex in August and I knew really quickly that something was working for me because um, with one week in, I went to get the uh, Little Debbie's cupcakes out of our cabinet for our youth group that met at our house on Wednesday nights. And um, I'm telling you, Little Debbie and I were tight. <laughs> you know, I loved them. And I was a sugar addict completely my whole entire life. And I was getting those out and I thought, I don't have to have those. There's not something in my brain saying eat one, two, or three. I don't have to have them. And that was a first ever. And so then a few weeks in, um, not only did I not want the bad food, I wanted good food. And if you had told me that I would ever in my life crave Brussels sprouts, I would have told you you were nuts because that did not exist in my house. And um, so the good food was what we wanted and so I would say that by December, I had lost about 35 pounds, which was amazing, I know. And um, you should think I was feeling better, but I really wasn't because November, December is the tough months for a music teacher with all the stress we have going on. And so I was in full autoimmune flare and then probably the worst of my life. So um, I can remember my son would have to literally help me out of the car. Um, my husband would help me get off the couch and I'd be like, Sarah, I would go and sit on the couch till it was time to go to bed and have someone help me to bed. Um, I was so miserable and could barely move. And um, so in January, I started on ease and I took the loading dose one night and the next morning I could put my rings on. And that was the first time in months that I had put them on because my hands were so swollen and I was super excited about it. And um, I did the loading dose through January. And in February, I took my bottle of ease to my rheumatologist and I wanted him to see it and see what he thought. And he looked at the ingredients and said, this is wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Keep doing it. I'm not going to put you on hydroxychloroquine today. We're just going to use this. And I will say I am a year and a half in on ease two years on triplex and no autoimmune flares. Um, that's huge to me, um, to be able to move and to do and to not hurt. And so, you know, that is now being controlled. He also now has given me a letter of recommendation to use for my HSA, my health savings account, that um, Plexus is my regimen, nothing else but Plexus. So that's cool. And um, so it makes me a better teacher. Like Sarah said, it makes me a better teacher because I can move and I can do and I can have energy and run around and be crazy with them. Um, the other thing I was dealing with was anxiety. And being a music teacher is stressful. And as I said, April, May, November, December always brought those stresses on. And um, one of the reasons that I know that Triplex works is about a year ago, I had one of my students that I've had for probably six years now, and she's been in lots of productions with me, and she came up to me, and she said, what are you doing? And I thought, what do you mean, what am I doing? She said, no, 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 no. You are so calm. You are scaring me. What are you doing? And my thought was, the pink drink works. 
And um, so it did. It has given me my life back. My anxiety is pretty well gone. And I wish I had found it earlier. Um, I joke that with my son, he's 20. When he came out, fear came in. And I was the anxious mama. And I think if I'd had plexus sooner, I would have been a much better mom just because I wouldn't have been scared all the time. And um, I know I'm a better mama now. And I'm a better teacher now uh, just because the show's going to go on and it's going to be good. And my kids are going to be good. And I'm not stressed all the time. So uh, to end, I'm going to say my waistline's down, my pain's down, my anxiety is down, my skin tags are gone because of all the sugar, my allergies are gone, my sugar cravings are gone, my energy is up and through the roof, my inflammation is down, and by the way, uh, those of you doubting on Plexus to use it for your health, uh, you get better from the inside out. My hair, I'm 54 years old, my hair has never been this long or this healthy, or this thick in my entire life. And the only thing I've done is plexus. And so it works. I can't say enough good about it. And if you're doubting, 60-day um, money-back guarantee. And trust me, you will not regret it. Thanks, everyone. Have a blessed night. Wow. These stories are incredible. Um, thank you so much for sharing, Valerie. If you um, wouldn't mind just making sure that you're your uh, device is muted. Sometimes there's just crazy feedback if we're not muted. So if you'll just check to make sure you're muted, that would be awesome. And we're gonna pass it off to Holly Stark. Holly, can you hear me? She may be in a storm too. What's going on down south, people? Hey guys. I can't get my camera to do what I need it to do. There we go. Y'all, I taught on Zoom for so long and, you know, the summer hit and I forgot how to use it. So here we are. Um, I'm so excited to be getting to share, getting to share with you guys tonight. It's been such a gift for Plexus to come into my life. Um, I was diagnosed with fibromyalgia when I was 19. Um, when you are sleeping between classes because you literally can't go to school without being miserable um and when you are getting eight hours and then 10 hours of sleep and just not feeling like yourself that's not normal um and so i got a fibromyalgia diagnosis they told me to eat right and sleep well and do mild exercise and you'll be fine um and so for 10 years i managed my fibromyalgia that way um but i was still miserable and I knew that when I was going to, when I wanted to be a mom, I wasn't really sure that I would be able to mom and teach at the same time. Um, and I was terrified. And so three different times I reached out to Kara, my, my friend who was talking, sharing Plexus and I inconsistently tried Plexus twice because I wasn't sure it was going to work for me. And when I didn't see results in like a week or two, I quit trying. And so I still felt bad. Um, when I was five months pregnant with my first daughter in 2019, I said, I don't care if this is snake oil or if it's voodoo magic, I feel awful and I will not be able to be a mom and be a teacher if I don't feel better. And so I started and I was consistent and I have not taken pain medication more than a couple Tylenol since I started in 2019. And I used to take six a leave at a time just to function. And I used to take sleep medication so that my body would relax enough for me to sleep. Um, and that's not the case anymore. And so for the last three years, I have been able to teach and chase a very rambunctious toddler around. Um, and I've had the energy to spare. Um, and it's been an absolute gift. I, I would say that I don't have fibromyalgia anymore uh, because I don't have aches and pains. I sleep like a rock. Um, and now I have a four-month-old at home. And 
I very rarely finish my coffee because I don't need it. I got four hours of sleep the other night and I, I am tired, but I'm not exhausted. Um, I'm still able to run around and hang out with my kids. And I started a new job a couple of weeks ago and it's been insane. And I have had the mental focus to be able to be fully present in my new job and be present with my girls when I get to be at home. And it has been an incredible gift. Um, one that I love to share with other people because you, you shouldn't be dealing with fibromyalgia at 19 or 29. You shouldn't be exhausted <laughs> at 29. Um, that's way too young to deal with any of those things. And so if I can be a gift and a light to other people and be their source of hope that there's another way, um, that's my prayer is to be able to just show people that you can feel better. Um, and I, side note, I, my dad is like anti-medication, anti, he doesn't consistently take anything. Um, and he called me this week and said, Hey, do you have any more of that sleep stuff? Um, my doctor just tried to put me on sleep medication and I don't want to take it. And so I was like, sure, here, have my bottle. I can't sleep through the night right now with a four month old. So you can have it. And I called him today to ask him how he slept last night. And he said he slept from nine until six. And guys, he has not been sleeping hardly at all because of stress from work. And it has been such a gift to know that even if he's not going to be consistent with it on the days that he's going to take the sleep products, like my dad's going to feel better. Y'all, if you hear anything tonight, I want you to hear that there's hope. There is hope for a better way. There's hope for feeling better, for being the best version of yourself. Um, and there's hope that you can show up in a really big way for other people too. So I'm thankful for you guys. Thankful that you got to be on and um, I'm going to pass it off to Hannah. Wow. I feel like we could just end it right there. That's incredible with the power of those stories. Amazing. I just think it's such a testament <clears throat> to hear how you can support your body in a natural manner without the medications. And, um, and it's just when you address those root issues with the gut health, the decreasing your inflammation and balancing your blood sugar, and getting better sleep, like it has so much power. And my story um, can go in with that too, where it's just, I thought I was healthy. I exercised, I ate well. Um, I'm a nurse by trade. And so I considered myself healthy, didn't have any issues. So I thought, but I wanted a good multivitamin. Um, I had been through a couple pregnancies and understood like I need needed to fill my body back up. And I spent months researching the ingredients because I was nursing a baby at the time and I wanted to make sure that there was nothing harmful in it. And I was just floored with the things that I learned um, and how connected our body is to your gut microbiome and the things that I mentioned before. So um, like I mentioned, I didn't think anything was going to change, but when I wasn't depending on caffeine to make it through my day, um, I didn't need to um, take naps. I wasn't revolving around the next time I could sleep. I seriously would count down the hours to my kids' nap time so that I could sleep with them. Um, I was crashing at the end of the day, just chronically exhausted. I remember sitting at my work computer and typing and like closing my eyes. Like I could fall asleep with my eyes open. I was so tired. So that was life-changing. And still now I have four children and I function better now than I did when I had those two kiddos. And so- that just speaks volumes to how that can impact the way you are as a mother, a wife, daughter, friends, coworker, like just how you show up in your day. Um, another quick couple few things that changed for me was my digestion regulated. I was constipated and bloated for as long as I could remember and just dealt with pain. And then um, my sugar cravings were out of control. So that got reined in. I was passing up the donuts in the break room and didn't need my sweet treat fix at night. <clears throat> um, another unexpected thing was my milk supply took off. 
So I was struggling with it with my first baby and then again with my second. And she was six months old when I started. And then I've since been through two pregnancies and two more nursing journeys, postpartum journeys. And I cannot speak enough about how important and like how much better my third and fourth pregnancies were than my first two with just not being dealing with the inflammation. Um, my blood sugars were stable. I didn't have the acid reflux. My sleep was okay. Even though you're still up peeing all night long. Like I just, um, I felt good and I wasn't napping all day, every day being pregnant, like keeping up with my other kids. So I've just always really been passionate about fueling your body with good things that it's needing and, um, filling those gaps. And so then also sharing this has been a huge gift, um, for our family and what it's done. And it has allowed me to step into actually being the teacher at home, <clears throat> teacher at home. So I've stepped away from nursing and now homeschool with my four kiddos and, there's no way that this would be if I didn't feel like I did. And if we were not supplementing our income through Plexus, through sharing this gift and blessing other people um, with their health and helping them on their journey. And so it really is such a gift in all the ways. Oh and here's two of them. <laughs> wow. Thank you, Hannah and Holly and Sarah and Valerie. Um, again, I'm sorry that we weren't able to hear Valerie or uh, Angela's, but we'll have her share on Trust Your Gut. Her story is just as beautiful as these four ladies. So I hope that you um, are walking away tonight, maybe a little bit more educated. I know for me, I knew nothing about gut health before I started Plexus. I knew nothing about the products. I was just seeing a lot of people seeing a lot of changes in different areas of their health with just a few like plexus ingredients uh, or a few plexus supplements and so that's what was intriguing to me and then hearing all the stories made me wonder like wow well, what if like what if i tried them what would that look like for my health what would that look like for my family and taking that step to try has changed everything for our family so whether you're interested in just getting stronger in your health, being more aware of your health and taking care of yourself, being proactive in your health. Or if you're interested in that, plus what Hannah was talking about, that freedom, being able to leave a job. And now she has this time freedom to be able to be at home, homeschooling her children for kids. How do you do that? She's beautiful. And she homeschools for kids. Like you gotta, you want to hate her, but you love her. Um, but you know, you might be interested in hearing a little bit more about that. That's the beautiful thing about this business about Plexus is that we have so many opportunities for your health and for just changing things for your family. So, um, thank you guys for being on. I encourage you to have a conversation with the person who brought you here. Um, we do have a really great discount code right now. Um, that your person, if you are interested, um, that they can share with you. It ends August 31st. So you want to take advantage of that. And um, I think we'll go ahead and do the drawing for the guest. And actually, I'm not going to do drawing. It's going to be all the guests. So it's going to be Molly, Melissa, Holly, and Melissa. And your um, friends who invited you, Kimberly, Rachel, Nancy, and Elaine, you all eight will get just a little gift from me. I'm going to send you a sample goodie bag of some of the plexus products for you guys to try out so if you can get your address your mailing address to the person who invited you and then you guys just send that on over to me kim rachel nance and elaine send those addresses over to me i'll try to pop those in the mail on friday tomorrow or monday um but we appreciate you guys being here thank you so very much um you guys have a wonderful night we'll talk to you guys later Bye bye